Yo, 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 what's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Tony Tone, back with another video. Y'all know what time it is, that Power Book 2 Ghost Review. Y'all ready for this recap of Episode 4? Let's get down to it. It's your boy, let's bring it to you. Alright, y'all. Me, myself, personally, first of all, I'm going to say my rating from 1 to 10 I give this episode, episode 4 of 10, because everybody was on point. Everybody did their job of making sure that Tariq get on top, you know. And I'm going to say that part. Now, to the show itself, um, The Prince, you know, that's what it is. And um, it's basically about what Tariq is pretty much um, knocking out the competition to get on top so he can do his thing and sell his drugs to, of course, get him on my jail. And uh, where it started off is where um, Tariq's going to phone with uh, Monet and they're breaking down the deal of how they're going to sell their drugs and get things going within the um, school and everything. And uh, she's giving him rules and what needs to be done. And Tariq's like, you know what, I got you. I got you covered. So everything you saying, I know what I need to do. Let me get on top of it, and we can make this thing happen. You know, and after that goes on, uh, Monet, Monet and uh, Kane are um, talking to the um, GTG and uh, telling them, hey, look, we got we got a new thing going on, so we're going to cut y'all off for a while because y'all keep doing y'all thing and keep messing up my business, and I ain't trying to do that. You know what I mean? So Monet cuts them off, and then before you know it, uh, little guap calls her a poonsa. Uh, 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 and, and I'm just say that that, cause uh, you know, he called her bad weird. You know what I mean? And he she she like what? What you call me? Poonsa back at you. You know what I mean? Back at you, buddy. You ain't saying that, but I'm glad. You know. And uh, right before he get ready to say it again, Kane beats his butt. You know what I mean? Literally beat him down to the ground. You know what I mean? But uh, he ain't have a chance. You know what I'm saying? Then after they get through with that, they walk off and uh, Monet's like, hey, you beat his butt. Hey, I like that. Keep that going. Stay, stay, stay sticking to that. When I need you to do something, you own it. You know what I mean? And uh, that's how that went down and everything, which was pretty cool. And um, moving along, uh, back at uh, the house or whatever for Monet and everything, where Monet and Diana and Dre and Kane all were sitting around. And they're talking, and then Monet's like, hey, look, guys, we got a new new uh, person aboard. It's going to be Tariq. They're like, what? How you got this dude on? You just said don't do it. Now you're doing it. But anyway, she got him going. And um, she told uh, Dre to go check him out, see how he ran his operation and everything. And uh, Kane like, hey, no, I'll go do it. Let me, let me go talk to this dude. She like, no, chill out, chill out. Then Diana said, let me go do it. She like, definitely not you. You ain't going to do it, no. So she get Dre to go do it, and he go to the school and everything. And right instantly, when uh, Tariq see Dre, he like, what you doing, man? I already know what you want, man. Hey, I got this dude. I'm about to leave for class, but he want to stick around, stick around. But, hey, I got, I got to go. And um, that just lets you know how how um, Tariq is smart on, and on top of his game. He already know what he was there for. And, um, you know, he pretty much told him, hey, you want to stick around and see what they got going on? Cool. That's fine. No problem. But uh, just funny, Dre sticks around, and he ended up going to class with Tariq, and ended up getting to a, into a little session with this class, is with this guy that Tariq goes to class with, but kind of find out the secret we didn't know till we find out later on in the episode, which I get to in a little while that I will tell you guys. Shh, shh, I'll let you know it's a secret. But um, you know, he he found out about that and everything. And uh, they go to class or whatever. He's in that class talking to the other guys. And he get partnered with this dude. And they, you know, do their thing for within the class to do the assignment. And, uh, of course, we're moving on. And uh, so uh, I forgot the guy name that he, that to his crew with Braden, I think. Oh, no, I'm sorry. Let me go to this part. Uh, Tariq meets up with... Uh, Stein's new partner, which is his supposed to be wife, he the husband thing. But anyway, meets up with him and they make a deal to 
get the everything, get the ball rolling with the um selling of the drugs within the school. And uh, Tweet's very smart about it. He's going to do it through an app. And the app is going to be able to allow the students in the, in the, in the school to, you know, get their drugs going and things of that nature of what they want for whatever class they're in. You know what I mean? And they mainly do it through the financial kids or whatever. And uh, Tariq's like, hey, this is what we're going to be. I'm going to be a tutor to these kids. Everybody going to know what's up. For they need help, come holler at me. You know what I mean? For the tutor. You know, the first thought, he was like, wait a minute, wait a minute. Can I get a cut? Man, yeah, low cut. Then he like, no, nah, you know what? Let me do five percent. Okay, cool. We'll go. We'll go with that. So they straight. They did get that going. You know, everything going good. And um, so moving along. Uh, they get to uh, Cooper Sacks and um, Davis McClain. Then, then the um, chambers with the um judge and everything. They're going over the case and everything, and pretty much. McLean's uh main objective is to um pretty much uh get U.S. Attorney literally U.S. Attorney she's gonna be called that now U.S. Attorney sex off the case and he's doing what he can to get him off the case and everything they're going back and forth with, with the judge of hey he's doing this and he's doing that not by the book you know doing it the wrong way and they bring in uh your girl um Sergeant uh. Blanca, cause I I'm gonna say I forgot her last name. I think my regrets, my regrets. I think. Forgive me if I forget. But um, anyway, she's pretty much trying to do her best, literally do her best to say, yeah, he did this and that. Yeah, he was wrong, cause she's trying to cover her butt, not cause she know how he is. And uh, you know, and then sex come and say, well, hey, judge, she ain't see me do all this. She wasn't no actual eyewitness. She ain't literally see me do it. So she like, you know what? The judge said, scrap all these questions since she ain't really see nothing. So. That pretty much a blow it out deal. So they say, you know what, I'm gonna get uh my client say, you know what, I'm gonna get um another liar, literally another liar <laughs> into the mix. Uh councilman Tate, you know what I mean, to get him going into it. First he didn't wanna do it, then he like, hey, go ahead and do it, he's gonna knock it out, get out of the week. He goes up there, do his thing and lies literally like he does and uh <laughs> Then uh, McLean, like, hey, you a liar too, man. You never know, lie, man. Get out of my face. You know, he ain't like that. So, but that's how that went down. They, they went back and forth to trying to get him, um, you know, going or whatever. All right, anyway, guys, moving on. Got a lot to talk about. Uh, and to the next part of it is the fact that, sorry about that, getting a little too comfortable. Uh, the other part is that um, your butt to read. Trying to get a little wet, wet, you know what I'm saying? He trying to do his thing with them girls, you know. I mean, uh, Diana, you know, uh, he got into a little, little problem where, as uh, I think the guy named Braden, I think, said, hey, grand opening about to be closed opening, meaning that they had the money but no supply. So we had to call it, call these people, hey, they need this supply coming along. So um, Monet tells Diana to go run the supply to um Tariq to go ahead and get the um uh, people going to get the drugs in to you know what I'm saying keep everything flowing. So she goes in and everything and she like, you know what I'm gonna do my thing down and say, Bump mama, I'm gonna do me. So she go up there and start kissing on Tariq, da 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 cause that was she wanted to do in the first place. That's why her mama told her to stay away. But anyway, they get into it, kissing and everything and he comes Drake knocking on the door. What y'all doing? Like, what you doing? Where you been at? You know what I mean? And then he give her that look. Like, you know what I've been doing. So, here's my secret I'm going to tell you guys. Uh, come to find out, your boy Dre is actually gay. Dre and gay. <laughs> Don't that rap? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, he doing this thing. He couldn't get it going because your mom called. And then he missed the call. So, he ended up calling his sister. And she told him to put him on. When they told her on speakerphone, she was going on. Anyway, that's that how she ended up going through the school and everything. But, uh, yeah, Tariq got his first girl trying to give him a kiss and everything, trying to get it going. Knock on the door. Throw them off. You know. Then also, too, let me do a little um, backtrack. Um, in the class, uh, the professors are doing a... Um, doing a program where everybody able to participate who want to participate and um where they can try to get to the um this program we're able to 
pretty much get out of school free. I mean, not free, get out of school early for us for three years and other things too. And um, the one that pretty much candidate, I mean, signed up for it is, of course, Tariq and uh, Lauren and other, some, I think another person too. But anyway, um, Lauren uh, invites the professor and uh, to his mom, to her mom house. To you know, saying talk about the program and everything, and then he's like, "Cool, no problem." So let's invite um Professor um uh, Carol. I forgot her name. The other girl, the lady that they was that was his girlfriend. They he invited her, and then Tariq comes in as well to you know see what the competition gonna be about. Anyway, all three of them go to the house or whatever. They are having a discussion about the book Prince. And now uh, Tariq breaks the book down to to uh, Lauren's mom. And uh, she's like, you know what? I like that. Let me go back and read that. That sounds very interesting to what he told her about the book. And um, then uh, Lauren said, hey, can't we find this book that uh, my mom needs to show the professor about his other novel that he had? You know. And um, then um, Lauren and Tariq talking, doing their thing, and... Lauren say, you know, I got a secret. You got a secret, you know. So let, let's let's see what's up with these secrets. So she like, so you better not tell you. So they end up kissing, knock knock on the door. Here come her boyfriend. Like what? I'm throw that off. So Tariq had twice, same day, literally same day. Two girls trying to get at him, trying to get him that wet wet. Yeah, I know what I mean, you know. But uh, I tell y'all the funny part at the, at the end of the, the show it was real funny how Tariq got her back. But um, anyway, y'all um. Also, come to find out, with two professors, they get they go home, get into an argument. Well, I didn't go home anyway. He she went to her house and he went there with her to whatever discuss th- some things or whatever about the um house and how he tried to play her and yeah you want me still this and that and come to find out they end up having sex or whatever da 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 got it going you know and they also had a lot of sex scenes in this in this episode. Uh, once again, Dre and um, the boy, the classmate dude, they got they almost got it going. Then uh, literally, uh, the two professors got it going. And uh, oh, guess what, guys? Guess what? Let me know in the comments what you think about this. Your boy McLean and uh, his assistant Paula, they got it going because he cheated on his wife with Paula. You know, when uh, they got a thing going on and everything, they doing their little thing. I said, what? They got your boy doing something. Let the man get a little taste, you know? Getting it going. And um, <laughs> also, I really forgot about this, guys. Um, Cooper Sats had a niece come in, almost got locked up, thanks to his um job that she was able to kind of wig a lot of it. And her name is, uh, I think, uh, Riley, I think. And uh, she, Cooper Sacks has her go check out um, Tariq for him to see how he does his operation and what's going on and how things are going on. But I don't think they're going to pan out too good because Tariq didn't really say too much, no, nothing to her. And um, also, that's where the scene with his competition literally getting knocked out the way of getting into a fight with, a, with his um, roommate and then gets expelled from school. And then the girl ended up getting high, so I don't think she can remember too much of what's going on with, with the uh, Tariq situation. <laughs> and then also, guys, for the last part of it is that Tariq and uh, Lauren end up in class, and Tariq, and then Lauren's trying to explain to Tariq, sorry about what happened last night, blase, blase. Tariq's like, you know what, it's all good, we young, we can play the game for how people want to talk to. And I, he literally said, this part of what I told you guys, I was going to tell you, I got options. You know, just because you got a boyfriend, hey, I got options too. You ain't the only one that got options, you know. And then literally by the time he said that, Diana had buzzed in on his phone and left him a text. But she's like, who's Diana? He went to smiling at her. I told you I got options, you know. But they still good. They still cool. But he was just letting her know, you ain't the only one that got other people too. But um, also, in the last part of it is the fact that Tasha got a text from uh, Dre showing him that Tariq was in school. And then uh, they let her know that, hey, keep everybody online as far as we still got this boy on the hook. So we just let you know, keep them both of them online so they can do what they need to do. But that's pretty much it, guys, with the episode. It was very exciting. 
good. Hope you guys go check it out. Can't wait for the next episode to come on out. Episode 5, but episode 4 was real good. Let me guys know what you think in the comments about it. Once again, Power Book 2 Ghost Episode 4 was really, really good, guys. Thank you guys for watching. That was my opinion about it. That was my thoughts about it. Sorry, excuse me. Um, this your boy Tony Tone. Subscribe, subscribe. Thank you, new subscribers, for watching. You're always welcome to come back for more. Give me some likes. Give me some likes. Hit that notification bell. And this your boy Tony Tone. I'm out. Peace.